Hello, my Aesirolic. So today we will now continue the next chapter of The Legend of Korra. So we're basically almost done with the game, actually. So that's neat. So there's this stupid effing old man hoon dude. I hate him. He's annoying. Stop laughing! Why doesn't he talk? Oh my god. Damn it. I hate when he does that. His laugh is annoying and he doesn't have any animation. This is where the game gets really trippy, by the way. Uh. Your temple? No, it can't be. That's why I kind of want to call this uh, Korra's spiritual drug trip. Because <laughs> that's what this is. Uh, it's, help uh, me, Korra! What's going on? Is that supposed to be Raba? That's the one thing I never understood. I think that's supposed to be Raba talking to Korra. Uh, it hurts. Please help me. Especially the um, uh, the fact that this is like a spiritual thing going on, and she's the light spirit. Yeah, I think that's Rava. She's like, help, I'm hurt. The white spirit is hurt. That, that would make sense. But if that was the case, then um, that should have be affecting Korra, since the white spirit... Shut up. Take your time. You have all eternity trapped in my illusion after all. Shut up. Anyway. Um, yeah, the white spirit Rava is within the Avatar. Basically, the Avatar is... When your previous incarnation defeated me a thousand years ago, I vowed to exact my revenge in this life or the next. Now, it's time to settle the score. Uh, whatever, whatever. So anyway, uh, the Avatar, it's essentially kind of like, uh, for those of you who watch Naruto, uh, it's basically a Jinchuriki, a person with a spirit sealed within their body, which enables them to have their abilities. Uh, the Avatar is basically that. So the Avatar is a human uh, with the powerful uh, white spirit Rava sealed within them. See, the thing that I find controversial about that, though, that kind of messes with the continuity is, okay, you guys remember how Aang got really, really pissed that um, Appa went away, that, that he was taken, and he has, uh, thanks to computer, you know, voice editing, uh, the voice actor for Aang has this really distorted, almost demonic sounding voice saying, tell me where Appa is. Uh, so yeah, where was the white spirit then? I'm pretty sure Rava does not give you a demonic voice. Because she's, you know, the white spirit. That's one thing that annoys me a little bit too about the whole white spirit crap is that, see, that kind of ruins the fact that, uh, the avatar is supposed to be neutral. Not good, not evil. You know, even though the avatar saves the world or whatever, the avatar is supposed to be a neutral sort of embodiment. Of, of, you know, spirituality and all that crap. That's supposed to be super, super goody good or evil. It's just neutral. But whatever. 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 I'm just going to kill all of you. These equalists are so simple. Sprinkle in a few words about the equality they crave and they dance in the palm of your hand. Pathetic humans. Um... Hoondoon is human too, like what the hell? Hoondoon is, st Hoon Doon is stupid, and I find him annoying, and he's just a stupid antagonist. He's just, I'm a scary old man, I laugh maniacally, fear me. That's all he is, fear me, I am evil. You stupid. Oh, damn it. I mean, you know, thankfully this is an excellent way for me to level up my um, elements, I guess. Okay, I'm trying to do that, that what do you call it, that, that kick, cause that, that kick, um, allows Korra to shoot out multiple fireballs, that's always nice, there we go. Korra, do the freaking kick, or, or the punch, I mean, the punch. No, earth is unbreakable, or earth bending is unstoppable, so no. Okay. But yeah, um, now we're finally facing off against Hoondoon, sorta, of, I guess. 
Like, that's why I'm not sure what to make the thumbnail for this to be. I'm really not sure what I'm going to make a thumbnail. But I know what I'm going to call it. And I don't care about the YouTube censorship because, see, that's the upside of me being a really tiny channel. Um, that technically doesn't apply to me. Um, I've cussed before, I've played super violent video games before, and nothing's happened to me, so really that just affects, the, you know, uh, bigger YouTube channels, not small people like me. There we go. I guess I'll do, I'll, you know, do some water bending too. I don't know. There we go. But yeah, Hoon Doom is just a stupid failure of a villain. I want to do blue charge. No, 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 fully charged, fully charged, fully charged. There we go. Yeah, our fetting is so freaking OP, oh my god. But yeah, I need to buy some more attacks. I need to buy more attacks. Oh god, these guys again? Uh, okay, I get that Hoon Doom's trying to be philosophical and talk about, you know, the equalists, and I was talking about how the triads suck, and how they're greedy, or whatever. But it's like, they, they, they are not important. They're stupid. They're all stupid. They've been using recolors the, the entire time, and it's annoying. I'm the avatar, you idiot. I can earthbend too. In fact, that's how she beats up the Earthbender in, in the uh, show. She does Earthbending against the Earthbender, so... Oh my god, no! No, 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 no. You know what, screw it, I'm just gonna do what- Oh my god, no, no. I'm dead. Yeah. Just do the waterbending. Just do the waterbending. Since my attacks are faster, that should work. And the waterbending is long range as well, so that helps a lot. There we go. But yeah, um, the triad is not special. The equalists that they are, they were they were trying to give off a sense of equality. Oh look, those were the spinning gates for core practice airbending movement. So that's nice. Or oh, the little details. So that's what this is just gonna be. It's gonna be trippy visions and trippy um, visuals, basically. You, you can't actually fight him yet. Who <laughs> doing? Why doesn't he actually talk? Oh my god, I hate it. Just, 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 just animate his mouth, seriously. But yeah, so he has dark energy and he makes you experience trippy visuals. Mm. Nice. That's funny. That's funny. But yeah, I have bending, so that's not really being powerless. Okay. So yeah, more pro bending. That's great. So yeah, that, that, now we have, uh, I guess, Super Saiyan 3. Wait, no. These, these are the, uh... It, it, these are separate characters. So yeah, they're not, they're, not, they're not the, uh... What do you call it? They're not the, um... Triad. But yeah, um, I, um, I don't like Who Knew, he's just a stupid character, they're trying so hard to make him cool and, you know, intimidating, but he's really not, he's just a stupid effing old man who laughs at you constantly for some weird reason, and, uh, that's really all it is. No. I'm actually already almost got the water guy, so I'm gonna see if I can damn it. Oh, that's funny, it's like chaos rules oh. You know, if it wasn't for the stupid YouTube copyrights, I, I would try to play that one song in Rock Band. I think it's in Rock Band that goes Anarchy. I think that's what it's called. But yeah, that, that's what this is. The, a stupid I think Undo would be like best friends with the Joker from uh, the Dark Knight series of movies. But yeah. Come on. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay. Oop. There we go. I am winning. Oh my god. Come on, Cora. 
God, I suck at preventing, I really do. Okay. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Stupid bunny spirit. Which, uh, by the way, these guys are actually in uh, the show, so that, that, that's a nice little reference to the show. Okay, come on. Come on. Almost got him. Okay, there we go. There we go. I'm winning. But yeah, um... Give up, shut up. It's annoying. But yeah, I really do uh, like this game, but oh my god, does it have issues. Yeah. Well, I win, because I have more of the area covered. So, suck it. Okay, okay. Do I get to fight them more? Yes, this is when you're more up close. That's nice. That's fun. I, I like when you get to fight more up close. Screw the rules. Rules are annoying. I agree. Screw the rules. Unless it's like, you know, like, like for driving. I don't mind, you know, like rules for driving. You know. Rules are annoying. I don't like them. There is only pain. But yeah, um, well, um, I don't really like rules, so that's fine by me. I wouldn't, I wouldn't really be much of an avatar. Uh, okay, see what I mean, see what I mean? So, it's technically the triad, technically. You're through. No, I'm not. What's wrong? Oh god, I love it. It's, it's hilarious. It's, it's, it's essentially, um, the same character. Like, like, they use a lot of the same animations, but yeah, whatever. Personally, I would like pro betting to be like this, where it's more like actual boxing or something, where you're more up close. I think that'd be more fun. Oops. Okay, so now the camera's all weird. Oh yeah, stupid effing hoon dune. Stu oh my god, it's, it's Attack on Titan. Gonna have sex with the bees and the eagles. That's what this is. It, it, it's freaking Attack on Titan now. With giant hoon doing, I love it. It's hilarious. But yeah, it's freaking Attack on Titan now. Oh my god, I'm done. Hang on. Hoon doing, leave me alone, you idiot. I like how the Earth one's just not really doing much of anything. But I was dodging. That's not. That, that doesn't make sense. Go away, alright? Hoon doing, stop standing there. You're stupid. I don't like him. He's annoying. He's just a dumb character. I'm, I'm doing this all over again. This is what the gameplay is. So there's probably nothing I can do about it. This is what the gameplay is. <sighs> Freaking Hoon Doom. Why, 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 why don't they make his, you know, mouth move? It's annoying. But yeah, so this is also a bit of a hint to Season 3 with the Red Lotus and how there are a group of criminals who, you know, like chaos. Or whatever. Spoilers. Yeah, um, spoilers. I, I'm playing as. Whatever. But yeah, um, so they're trying to make it look like Korra's gonna go mentally insane by being in the hallucinations, but. It's really not that bad. Anyway, this so yeah, this, this is uh, major spoilers for uh, season uh, two. This is Korra in her spirit form. Uh, so yeah, I might as well tell you then what's going on. So basically, for those of you who don't know, uh, in season two, the season two finale, uh, Korra uh, meditates by the tree of time, and when she does. She does old school bending. There's a lion turtle who, you know, in the first Avatar, mentions that uh, before uh, people bent the elements, they bent their soul, the spirit. And that's essentially what Korra said. This is her spirit. Um, without Rava, this is her, you know, powerful. Well, well I know. I guess it would be a little bit of Rava, because when Janora bends her spirit, it's not like that. Anyway. Um, so yeah, Korra bends her spirit by the um, Tree of Time, 
and that enables her to then um, uh, become a spirit. So I guess then uh, bending, you know, astral projection would be different than uh, bending your spirit by the tree of time. So I guess then this is what original bending was, you know, bending your spirit into a giant person, basically. So that's kind of cool. But yeah, she should have her lasers. I don't know why she doesn't have her lasers. Because Spirit Core can bend lasers out of her chest. And she's not doing it. But yeah. Um, I never understood why she was wearing clothes. Like, her spirit form should just be energy. Time is over. Be thankful your spirit has not far to travel. Oh, okay, then now, now we can actually do something else. Okay. That's nice. Gotta do my earth bending again. One, two, dodge, dodge. One, two, dodge. One, two, dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay. One, two, dodge, dodge. Yeah. One, dodge, dodge. So it's in between one to two hits, I would say. Yeah. One, two, three, pushing it, dodge, dodge. Okay, so yeah. It's really not that bad. It's not that bad. Okay, okay. Uh, but yeah, so Hoondoon wants to kill Korra because the past incarnation of the Avatar did something to him. I don't know. I mean, you know, they're trying to make this cool, you know, but Hoondoon's just stupid. I don't like him really. He's annoying. He laughs at you, like, a lot, and it's really annoying. It's like, I never understood that about cartoons, where the character has to laugh maniacally. Um... Yeah. I really shouldn't get the air scooter. That would be very useful. Right now. If I can just get away. Okay, one, two, okay. But yeah, um... Doom Doom is just a, an annoying character. I don't really like him. He's stupid. He just laughs at you. And he, uh, that's really it. He laughs at you and summons dark spirits or whatever. It's, 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 really, it. it's really it. Oh, can I purify it? Okay, good. There we go. Oh, she didn't say go in peace. Okay, then. whatever. But yeah, so as you can see, it's really not. Oh, damn it. Don't die on me, Cora. Don't die. Don't die. Okay. Don't die. Don't die. Okay. One, two, three. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Okay. But yeah, um, I, I, I like that he sends Cora into trippy hallucinations and it makes her question whether or not what she's seeing is real. You know, crap like that. I like it. But, um, it's just, I don't know. It's weird, like, I mean, it, it, it's fun, I like it, but it's like, who are you doing? You're stupid, why don't you do anything? Like, he's, he's sending lightning to you and doesn't really do anything, it's like, who are you doing sucks? Okay. Two, three, there we go, purify. And I, get, I keep getting brawn, so... According to these people, I suck. Oh, we're spending max out. Nice. Okay. Well, I need to max out the other elements then. Yeah, I should max out my other elements then. I think this is one of those scenarios where I'm supposed to get hurt. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's what this is. Okay, purify, purify. Purify. That's what this seems like. It's one of those scenarios where I'm supposed to get hurt. Yep, cutscene. Cutscene time. Oh no! Oh no! Yes! Ow! Ow! Cora's getting hurt. That's no good. Yeah. So, Cora's, like, dying, basically. His favorites are, like, ganging up on her. She's dying. Oh my god, Janora! What? What? Cora, remember. We are all one. Mm. There is no light or dark, no good or evil, no human or spirit. All are one. Um. 
Okay, I mean, that's a nice concept, but no, no, there is a human, there is spirits, you know, there is a difference between them in the world of Avatar. But yeah, whatever. Okay. Let go, Korra. The division between you and your enemies is an illusion. All are one. Um. Like, y y yeah, thanks. Okay, okay, thanks, Shinora. Um. You're trying to be philosophical, okay, great, but uh, Korra's still dying. Cool. She's getting. There is no light or dark. Oh my god. To fight another is to fight yourself. Um. Let go. Okay. Okay. Sama Janora. So yeah, you can probably guess what's going to happen here. Oh good, the point. Yes, the point of the... The Avatar is back. Nice. Avatar State... Oh god, yes. Avatar State is so OP. You're going to see what I mean now. But yeah, the Avatar state is so broken. You're gonna see what I mean now. Holy crap. Like, your your elemental powers are just so just beyond broken. I love it. Oh my god. Power trip. That's what this is. I love it. Oh, and you don't even need to change or switch the elements because you, you use all of them at once, basically. It's awesome. So yeah, this is this is all because of the light spirit. Shut up, who knew? This is all because of the light spirit Rava of the that the avatar is so powerful. I love it. Oh my god, the avatar stage. So powerful. I love it. And just this guy. I love how the Avatar State theme song uh, comes back on. That's nice. But yeah, they should have added the glowing effect to Korra's eyes. That's stupid that they didn't add that to her eyes. Oh well. You may have regained your Avatar powers, but our battle is far from over. Oh no. Uh, so yeah, he's using, like, evil energy, like, like, Maleficent, because she has green energy, whatever, I don't know. Now we're floating up in the sky, and I have to kill him, because he's evil. Whatever. Yeah. Oh, I got silver, I think. These rewards suck, and why does that cabbage look like it has a face? Oh, well. Okay, so, uh, we will continue the next chapter next time. I hope you all enjoyed this episode, and we're pretty much done. I think there's, like, uh, nine chapters for this game, and we're gonna do chapter eight, so we're pretty much done with The Legend of Korra, so I hope you all enjoyed, um, and I will see you all next time. Bye.